when you've done your research and development beforehand, what did you see in the Kusama blockchain than any other blockchain to make you decide to build on them? Uh, clean slate. Uh, it was really important. Well, I was, I was building Kusama at that time, so it was natural to build inside of it. But also uh, the fact that there were no incumbents, there, were no, there was no bureaucracy to hold us back. We were free to innovate as much as we wanted to innovate. Uh, we were free to build our own stuff and iterate really quickly, break things and retry uh, mm -hmm. without having to go through Makes the bureaucratic sense. process of standard approval and, and you know, all of that sort of stuff. So uh, it allowed us to really launch five full-fledged products in a year and come up with the best NFT infrastructure um, in the world. For comparison, um, the, the standard for adding royalties to NFTs was merged uh, late last year into Ethereum after three years of discussion. And this is two optional values added to the NFTs, two optional little um, values that you can add to them. They, this was a three-year discussion. And so um, when you take into account how much bureaucracy there was needed, how much, how much discussing was needed to just, to just make that little incremental upgrade, it was unimaginable to us how adding remark into it would, would look. So we decided to build first and then, you know, ask permission later.